Hey guys, so it's Erica. We are going to be checking out Trend's trauma special performance video. I am excited to be checking this out. I think I liked the villain, uh, the choreography of the song itself more than um, the day the title track for this debut um, but that could change because my opinion tends to change especially over time and it's been a while since I've checked out this song and it's a special performance video um, so yeah and the music video for that was really really sick but the choreography for villain with those raps girl genius never seen nothing like it that was sick as fuck um, but yeah but I'm still gonna even though like I prefer a b-side or whatever to a title track we're still gonna love and appreciate this one um, so I'm excited so you know what it like I mean, that's a cool formation to start out with. Intro. Nice camera work. Oh, one take. So far. A nice choreography. A nice blocking between choreography and camera. It's a cool warehouse set with the black outfits, but they lit up the back enough to where they're not fading into it. I think that was a cut, actually. Found it. Choreography is really nice and the way they did shoot this, you're really seeing everything about it. Because the way certain things are shot is it, it looks great camera work wise, but choreography wise isn't showing everything. But this is cool. This is really sick. And I'm kind of intrigued to see because a lot of this is playing with the camera and it's and it's doing an amazing job with it, what it looks like when they're not going like this with the camera. Fun editing there. Do -do -do -do. I like that moment. Oh! It looks even nice in black and white. That was nice. I like how the intensity comes up with the lights. That move would probably be a little awkward, but it looks nice on camera. <laughs> Nice, nice, really like that. I really, really like that. I still think I prefer villain sound wise and choreography wise, but this was really, really nice. And I like how there's what is the full, what are all the B sides? Um, Be My Love, we do have that. I think they release videos for all the B sides, which is really, really cool. I love when they do that. It is a mini album or like a EP, whatever. It's a, it's that's the thing. It's like Spotify would call it like an EP or like an LP, but then it's like a mini album to us. So it's a whole thing. But I like getting choreography for this, and I liked how it was shot. It was really really fun. I don't. I caught probably maybe two cuts that were maybe cuts. The way they edited the video, it could just be a drastic push in and out that just 
looked like a cut, but I would imagine that give them a break give the cameraman a break and give the boys a break you know what i mean um but i really did like it and like this they do like something like this or something and i'm like that looks so awkward to do but it looks great on camera i will say that i really like this choreography i think it's really nice i like the sound and like what they do with it it's very interesting right because i feel like villain and this one could have been potential title tracks for the debut so it's very interesting that they're kind of b-sides are filled with potentially title track type songs different than p1 harmony because i feel like a lot of p1 harmony songs can feel like title tracks like the production just is crazy on their b-sides as well as their title tracks but it makes sense why they do their title tracks the way they do their title tracks so that they choose to promote with those but their b-sides insane um but here it's kind of a different type of sound like they all kind of just feel title track like title tracks and stuff not necessarily like title track worthy but they feel like title tracks which is cool to get which is what I like about it that it's just these songs are hype enough and they're well produced enough to wear title track potential material choreography was really really nice I would be interested to see the camera or the choreography without the camera work um, even though it was blocked and choreographed really really well um, for what they did with it. it I would just be interested to be seeing what it looks like without it and I feel like what I love about how it was shot is the camera was wide enough most of the time to where you saw the entire choreography to where like I w probably wouldn't even need a dance practice to see all the choreography there's probably things I missed here and there you know um but it was wide enough to where we're seeing we're seeing everything. I feel like we got the whole choreography there um versus other stuff will cut off the choreography or the formation or whatever just to get close up on the members and stuff like that which makes sense for like performance videos and choreography videos but this one really gave us all the choreography which is what i loved about it um even with the fun different camera angles and stuff or camera directions because i'm doing this jazz um which was also fun to get that that's really fun to do that because that's more planning on top of already having a plan to do the camera work for um, choreography um, and it also had this sort of one take effect which was really really cool that looked really really nice and for a lot of it they were longer takes and stuff maybe two or three cuts what I saw again but I don't know if they did cut and they just matched the frame perfectly to where you couldn't even tell there was a cut or if they did truly shoot maybe three takes of the video and then just kind of cut the three best parts and all that other jazz but the editing was nice enough to sort of mask those as well and then maybe again it probably it maybe it wasn't even one and just the editing sort of made it look like it was a cut um but it was still really nice i really like the choreography i like the song itself this was fun really enjoyed it um so yeah go to break thoughts and comments down below what you thought about trends trauma special performance video if you like this video give this video a thumbs up if you liked me and want to see more of my videos go to hit that subscribe button if you want to see my videos the second they come out hit that notification button if you want to follow me social media twitter instagram such as tiktok description down below at the end screen share this video to your friends thank you guys so so much for watching love you and i'll talk to you guys later bye Talk about the you and me, baby